Hey everyone, and welcome back to the Binding of Isaac Afterbirth. I'm gonna play Eden today, because I like spawning with random items, basically. Alright, didn't spawn with the D12. Ooh, this looks like it could be bad. But then again, it also, I guess because the worm, I don't really know. So this item, once per room use, where uh, my tears explode. It seems pretty useless, unless you're really powerful, and if you're really powerful, chances are you have something that's more useful. So I don't really know how I feel about it yet, because I just haven't had it in a situation where it is anything other than basically useless. So, I don't really know. But I also have the ladder, which I'm going to promptly forget about, because not only do I always forget that I have the ladder, I didn't even buy it this time. So it's not even like one of those things where... Oh, you picked this up so you could use it, and then you forgot about it. I didn't even pick it up so I could use it, I just have it. But, uh, we'll see what happens. That's marked. I don't want marked. Marked, it's just not a cool item. Oops. Didn't recognize soon enough that that was a fire. Uh, marked means that you get a thing on the ground that is a crosshair, and it causes you to always shoot towards that crosshair. Never stop shooting. Uh, it's really inconvenient to use it to change directions or anything just because you can't instantly change directions. To me it seems like a purely negative item, but maybe there's some situation where it's real good? I don't know. But the moral of the story is I don't want it. And there's no reason for me to take it. Second Tinted Rock, still no bombs. That's why I'm running around looking for stuff. Alright. Alright. Last room, maybe? Can you do it for me? Can you give me a double bomb? Come on. Dang, I tried so hard. Wow, uh, luck down. Alright, so nothing useful this floor. That's good then. Didn't get the bomb I needed. Didn't get a key to go to the uh, shop to look for a bomb. Alright. If I see how it is. I see how it is. Alright, this is a little scary. Oh no, you can... Fine. Uh, there's the key I needed last floor, but this will get me to the item room, so it's still got, uh, it's still good. Nope. That was actually quite scary. Because of the way I was positioning myself to get that extra damage in, since my tears don't seem to do the job that well. At least they have a bigger hitbox. Oh, look at all these... Look at all these... Rock chests, stone chests, bomb chests, whatever. Call them what you will. We're at a, a lack of bombs, though. So I don't really get to take advantage of them. Alright, there we go. I'll do it. What are you? Homing tears for a room. Alright, could have been much better. Should have opened the other one, clearly. Because, you know, I, I knew which one would be the good one. I just decided to open the bad one. Thought it would be more fun. Don't seem to get the flies too often right now. Heart drop I actually need. Uh, by the way, I'm not ruling out Hush for this run. I was going to say, I, I really hope that that thing could just die. It's worrying me. Alright. There we go. Sometimes it's just a matter of leading them around until you actually have the thing properly positioned. Well, that was still a three-shot kill, it looked like. No, it wasn't. I lied. Alright, so that was the shop, I think. Now I have 15 cents. I'm going in because, goodness, this run right now. 
And then I'm going to find the item room probably, because there should be a soul heart, hopefully. Or something good. I, you know, sure, I'll roll the PhD. Pills can't be bad, only good or neutral. Sadly, most of the neutral pills are bad now. Uh, since they added a bunch of neutral pills and a lot of them are bad. And uh, you get two red hearts of recovery and uh, blood donation machines. And IV bags always pay out with one extra coin. And it dropped a pill. All right, so we got the D6. So this is the Isaac run that I should do if I want to try and find the thing, the D12 that I'm still missing for 1,001%, the last item in the game. So, you know, that's kind of cool. Can make dreams come true. All right, that's a black heart, three bomb drops of any kind. Dark bomb. Sure. Just because it's something that I uh, can take to lock in devil rooms that is good and so I can roll in the item room instead where I might actually get the item I'm looking for. So now there's a good reason that I really want to make hush. Uh, cool, that was up to me. I totally, totally could have done something about that one. Uh, because I have the ability to reroll. Uh, that's a couple more item rooms, basically, that I could get some use out of. This could be interesting. I only shoot all of these because they're uh, not nice. They shoot at me. Two spades. And then use that just to get back to full health. And then we add here, I guess. Uh, dude will drop a soul heart, black heart, or friendly or enemy spider. That's dark bomb. Every one and a half red hearts it picks up. It's half of a heart away from that right now. We on the case. All right, good start. Battery, though, that is a good start. Uh, I have a bomb. And it turns out it didn't matter. I wasn't going to take my chances with these dudes blowing it up for me, just, like, let it go, uh, do it myself. Then they, of course, shot perfectly where they would need to for them to blow it up for me. Ah, delightful. Wish I still had a black heart. But I lost that to nothing that I had any control over. Yeah, this is fine. Since I got hit once already, I'm just kind of letting it happen. But now I'm almost dead. So I gotta be careful again. This should be doable. Eh... Uh. This is uh, not a hard room by any stretch of the imagination whatsoever. But I gotta be careful. Nope. Nope. Okay, there's a bomb dude over there. I do have free secret rooms. All secret room entrances are just open. Did I not get the top secret room last floor? I walked past the boss, like, because it should have been close to the boss. And I don't know, if I didn't, I messed up. But I can't imagine how I didn't. Don't remember what was in there, so it's possible that it happened. I skipped it. Just forgot to uh, mention the item, so I forgot to take advantage of it. Uh, this is a locked room of some sort, so I would like to see it. I will buy that. Sounds good to me. Oh, good a bomb. It's about the best payout I've gotten. You know, gotten that one a few times. I still don't have full health, but we're we're alive. It's fine. Remember not to unlock the shop since I didn't before. Uh, that'll actually still be a locked door. Okay. 
Okay. Still a useless pill. Right, this time I found my top secret room properly. I already lost my devil room chance. Soul heart luck just isn't there right now. I guess I'll fight. Husk is easy. He's kind of stuck on that one. Do it again. Just because my damage sucks, I may as well uh, deal good damage how I can for now. Can still get the Devil Room, it's just unlikely. All right, that's good. I want that, but I want it later so that I actually have it for the next floor. That's uh, one health up and two soul hearts. And that'll help me a lot. Okay, good. Now we are fine. <sighs> now I just need the item room. I wish I had a black heart. I would absolutely use it for this room. Oops. Dang it. Making it hard for me to use my gosh darn ball bandages. I just not staying in the direction you're going so I can kill you with it. Like, I've got the setups. Thank you, sir. I just don't have the ability to get uh, you to do what I want. If that were just like a health up in the boss room, by the way, I would totally reroll it since I'm just wasting a bunch of rerolls right now. Ah, oh, god dang it. Nope. I need some health. I have to go pick it up now. I really can't afford that though. That's not a good thing to do. But hey. I'd rather not be dead. So. So be it. Okay. It's open. Now yeah, let's check the pill. Oh, god dang it. Curse the maze. What do you do? What do you do this for? Range up. Alright, well. Now I know. I have another battery if I need it. I just need to get five cents, which shouldn't be too hard. I might end up doing that. Chance of Cricket's head, something like that, would be good. <sighs> I, you know, I, I too hate rooms with useful things in them. These guys are easy to manipulate into getting killed by your orbital. And then you do that. Alright, buddy. I'm gonna need to have a talk. Talk about not making mistakes on champions. Full map for the floor. Maybe I'll use that next floor. Oh, or I'll get Cricket's head here. Alright, perfect. 0.5 damage up, 1.5 damage multiplier. I like how I still get the ladder for that one. Anyway, uh, that's kind of exactly what I needed to see. I might actually be able to kill stuff now with a relative level of comfort. Then again, maybe not. Could go either way. God, I hate these nerds. But we're good. We're good. Probably should have let him have that since he was half hard away. I'm going to do the challenge room now, just because I have this battery that could be very nice. I have extra keys for sure. See what I'm talking about? That guarantees every devil or angel room will show up and stay open, including the one I didn't get on this floor. It'll now be open. And then Serpent's Kiss means I win, basically what that item does. 
I no longer have to worry about taking red heart damage as well, which is good. So Serpent's Kiss gives me poison. Uh, if an enemy dies while poisoned, it has a chance to drop a black heart, and it's not an insignificant chance. So basically the item just rains black hearts on you, and you become healthy and damaging. It's really OP. So now I can go to the Devil Room and I have a roll for that. Krampus. Alright, the dream is use my orbital. You die easily, I reroll this. I get Guppy's Tail for more chest drops and less other drops, and I hopefully am fine with that. Hmm. Alright. This run turned around quickly. Made a good decision, basically. Got lucky with it. But it was a good decision. Oh, I think I also get poison on contact, which is cool. So chance to shoot a poison tier, chance to... or guarantee to poison on contact. Alright. Or that could happen. Alright, that's tempting. This is easy enough. As long as I kill the first phase of them, because the first phase has a really, really sucky attack. Hey, anytime you want to drop some black hearts, I am totally down. Anytime. Come on. Stop dodging so much. This is good. I do want to keep a good key supply, of course. Because keys are valuable stuff, and I have Guppy's tail. God, this is an annoying room just because of the freaking mushroom here. Where are the black hearts, man? It's been a lot of enemies. I need that. Since I have Goat Head, the guarantee of having just any health rather than a specific type of health is probably more valuable. Alright. We're all good. All good. Alright, you take the one, I'll take the other. See, that's why I didn't want to trust him, because he can do that. I think he was just resentful this time, though, because I picked up so many hearts that he could have had. So nice thing about the poison is the stacks on those enemies, all of them get it. It's a half heart away again. Except still none of them dropped black hearts, so I feel like Serpent's Kiss uh, is cheating me right now. It's just like, mm, I don't like you. And that's fair. Oh, I can wait in that room this time. That's cool. Oh my god, a black heart. Don't believe it. Kind of expected another one there, actually. Uh, the wig. That's... I don't have any charging stuff right now. I have an extra battery right there. Let's, uh... Let's even use both of them. Speed, range up, size down. Uh, it's technically a range down. But it is a shot height up. Oops. Regardless, is still good. Right, let's do this the easy way by resetting the room now. Thank you. Now that it's started doing something, I expect that I'll probably get more of them. Yeah, see, look at that. Sadly, I can't get to that way. I can. I have the ladder. See? Now that it started, it won't stop. It just had to get warmed up. It's having a bad day or something. And then it figured it out. Got back on its game. Serpent's Kiss once again OP. There we go. 
I don't really want another health up. I don't need one. More black hearts are better. 50% off on everything in shops is also quite nice. And if I get black heart across these, I have a ladder. It's fine. Thanks, buddy. Oh, I don't have a charge. I am dumb. I ain't even mad. But it doesn't matter. Never mind. It's fine. Uh, so I want Guppy's collar. 50% chance to revive at half a heart if I die. Little Brim's kind of tempting, but I could also roll it. Which is also really tempting. Is there a battery in here too? No, that was a greed fight, you silly man. So I'm going to roll it just because I could get Guppy out of it. I can't do that. Let's go in here, though. I'll press the button. That's what I was hoping for, too. A golden key to, by the end of this floor. That's really good luck. Alright, since it's not like I'm getting an extra charge out of things, I'm just going to go do this now. Because I'm over here now. Really? I have to bomb to get into you? That wasn't the case before. I'll just do this bombing now, so that I don't have to... There's Guppy. So that's, uh... Flight. Every time I hit with a tier, I spawn a kamikaze fly that does twice my damage. It'd be really nice if I got even one key out of this, you know? Thank you. Even one key. Uh, I still... I should care about Little Brim. I'll take Little Brim now. Alright, this is a fire rate delay minus one. So, that lets me bypass max tiers. The normal max tiers, of course. Uh, and it gets an increasingly good effect the more... Uh, the better my fire rate gets. So that's nice. It's also a chance at fearing an enemy. chance at shooting a tier that fears enemies, that is. Didn't need to go that way. So I'll take Little Brim. Because uh, my familiar's tears now also spawn kamikaze flies for me. Little Brim just uh, shoots a charge. Uh, he charges and shoots a brimstone. Good dude. Oops. There we go. So this is, uh, you know, just had to stick to it and we turned to run good. Shouldn't have done that. Oh, that's tempting. Poker chip is every time you open a chest, there's a chance. I don't know what the chance is. But uh, you either get twice as much stuff or you get no stuff. Well, you get a fly. So even better, am I right? So... We gambling now. Oops. Probably shouldn't have done that that way. I'll do this though. Of course, items and trinkets can't be doubled. So those aren't really worth that. So we'll see how this turns out. I'll pretty much give it to the end of this floor. Might not be worth it, might be totally worth it. We'll find out. Got more stuff for that one, I guess. More stuff or no stuff. Oh, I didn't see that there. Good to get a key. I'm gonna save my key. Do I roll a secret room? Oh, well, I don't have to. First room containing something I'd not rather use, so never mind. Okay. Little Brim's doing work for uh, enemies that I don't want to be bothered to have to figure out how to hit. Doesn't seem to be spawning flies, though. I wasn't sure if it would. 
what I thought it did. Alright, there we go. Another key. Find the item room one day. Maybe, if we're lucky. One makes you small. Smaller hitbox. Uh, I have an extra key. On a technical level. Probably wanted to go to the shop with it today. Okay. Thanks for the fly. It's also pretty likely that in the shop I find a key, so... I also lied, apparently. Let's roll those. Ability to hold two cards and a card drop. Runes count as cards, of course. I have another battery, so why not? BFFs increases the size and doubles the damage of my familiars. Uh, that's a huge pickup with Little Grim and a ball of bandages. Alright, do I get another full charge? This is the question. I would kind of bet no. But I'll find out. Because why not? Oops. And then I'll just take, take the battery because that's what's going to end up happening. Uh, Moon's a secret room teleport, but that doesn't matter because I've already been there. Yeah, that works. So BFFs doesn't buff my buddy here, uh, Dark Bun, at all. Just makes him bigger. I guess I'm out of luck here. So much for getting all the keys. I'll work on it. So far I can, I think I can keep the poker chip. Not feel like biggest idiot. Alright, enemies uh, that spawn other enemies, by the way, are great for uh, Serpent's Kiss if you want to farm. Evil range and shot speed up, and a black heart. Okay, I will take this. 0.5 damage up, 0.7 tears up, 2 soul hearts. And I'll reroll this. 1 damage up, 10% devil room chance increase, but really it's just 1 damage up. And I got a key. So, let's do this. Anemic. Alright, well, that's what we get. It's a range up, and if I get hit, I track blood on the ground for the rest of the room. That does pretty much useless damage, and it's not worth talking about. I don't think it was buffed, at least. But that's fine. Let's find out. Sister Maggie. Alright. Something else that spawns flies for me, I guess. That works. I mean, I already have a little brim in the first position, so that's good enough. Oh, nice battery. At least I do have the full map. Uh, or I have the ability to have the full map. Could use that to blow that dude up. Uh, I get to see the map, even if I have Curse the Blind, but I don't get to reroll effectively. I only get to reroll use items, which on the plus side means that if I get a use item, it could be the D12 and I won't be able to, uh... Like, I'm not gonna mess up. Because I'll just pick up whatever shows up. It'll be fine. I'm not gonna use my keys. Tempting as it is. Dang, got you a lot of stuff. Friend? Excellent. This is what I need. Keys for days. Permanent shop teleport. This is good news. Well, guess I have all the stuff I need here. Alright, and then spawn them out here. He spawns them as red hearts because that room doesn't allow non red heart hearts drops, spawns, whatever you want to call them. They just don't happen there. Not that it matters. 
I took damage, that is. Not so little brimstone doing good work. This is depths two, so I can't afford to go to the boss. I have the hermit, never mind, I can. I like how this run's taking 27 minutes already, though. That's uh, how you know you're in business. Bob's rotten head, alright. Yep. Oh, I thought I was out of the way enough. Chest run, of course. And what are you? Book of Sin. What are you? Lord of the Pit. Flight. <laughs> Thanks. And a speed up if I get something that modifies my speed. But, you know, that's totally a concern of mine, right? Uh, so the battery allows me to hold two full charges for my use item, which is actually great. It's me waste a lot more time with the D6 without worrying about it. Libra, oh boy. Attempts to balance my stats so to like lower my range to increase my damage or tears or something. Uh, it's overall not very good most of the time, but it also gives me six of each type of pickup. Uh, that's pretty good. So I ended up with 10 keys at that point. I'm liking, I'm liking that. I have this full map rune, but do I like need it? Probably not. So I'm not making hush, unfortunately. <laughs> There's just no way. So I have two rerolls, and I have one item to reroll, conveniently. So let's find out what we get. Can we become a thousand one percent? No, no, we cannot. So the whiz, I always shoot in Are You a Wizard style, but I shoot in both sides always, and. It doesn't lower my fire rate or anything, but it's really bad. That's fine, though. Okay, I have invincibility. Thanks to the Polaroid. Which is good news. So yeah, this pretty much kills, like, my chance of having a happy fun run. Because it's so impossible to hit pretty much most angles that you want to shoot. But I'll try my best to work with it. Lovers. Alright. Give Dark Bomb a gift. Dang, that luck though. So sad. I also have unlimited bombs this floor, but I don't really have a use for them. Wiz also gives you uh, Spectral, by the way. Sorry, Conquest. Not, uh, not your day. I'll take the Mark 1 damage up, 0.2 speed up, and a Soul Heart and Leviathan Transformations Flight to Black Hearts. Uh, 1 damage up, 0.4 speed up. Guess I'll roll this after all. I already have Fly Spawning, I don't need that. Too bad about Libra. Too bad. But at least I have good damage. Alright, man. By the way, the... Uh, I guess I'll drop the trinket now. Doing alright. Needed that money for something, something or other. Figured that the whiz, if anything, could hit those dudes for me. I don't have a use for any health from you right now. So these guys charge me at such angles as to make it very difficult to intentionally shoot at them, since they're trying their best to come straight at me from the middle. So that was not the direction. We're almost to full black hearts. Got to get there. Sh 
should be a great time. If I can ever poison another enemy. Not a black heart. Not interested in what you're selling. Can't believe it actually got the shot off. Fate's reward, sure. Shoots uh, my tears, basically, uh, at its own fire rate, but it has all my effects and damage and whatnot. Uh, it doesn't take certain tier changing things like the knife, and brimstone, and whatnot. It'll take Ipecac, though. But it shoots straight, and it is affected by BFFs, so I've got that going for me. Oh, we're getting real close. Hey, there it is. Alright, we did it. Except I'm taking Incubus. Which shoots my tears as well, but is also affected by BFFs. So, that's great. Oh, there was a soul heart there, wasn't it? Not that it matters that much. So since I... Uh, it's time to save keys, not open anything. Oh, we're back. So yeah, Incubus fully takes my tier effects and fire rate and everything. Unlike Fate's Reward. So even if my tiers are really hard to hit with, I've got a lot of them. And twice the damage on some of them. Half of them, in fact. Yeah, I'm getting out of here now. And for the key, I can open regular chests, no problem. Oops. Tinted rock, sure. Small rock. Thanks, buddy. One damage up if I get something that modifies my tiers, it's 0.2 tiers up, and if I get something that modifies my speed, it's 0.2 speed down. So let's go the wrong way again. Just had to get that out of the way. Alright. Dang, dude. Some of those go straight backwards. Like straight sideways, pretty much. It's so just the whiz is really bad, but not a big deal. Uh, yeah, I don't need to worry about you too much. Feels like I'm not spawning that many flies, even though I'm hitting with a lot of tears between me and my familiars. It's kind of weird. They're probably just getting used, though. Ah, almost. Good stuff. 16 keys, that'll be pretty good. I can do a lot of rooms in the chest before I go back to him get any rerolls done. Oh, ra ra. Yeah, that's that's what I have to say about that. You know, it doesn't even suck that much that Incubus is my third familiar with this build. It's actually pretty much purely good. Just because that means I get a better tier spread. And more accurately placed stuff. I like how I'm a tiny little cute leviathan. Alright, gonna go get that last black heart, because I can. Keep up the 12 black heart dream. Alright, it's not Curse of the Blind. Don't even care. Alright, so I'm gonna use this so I know exactly where to go to never find the boss. And then I'm gonna reroll everything until I find what I'm after. I guess I'll finish with Mega Satan, because I can, but I'm here purely to reroll and not to pick up anything cool, because I'm strong enough. Kind of forgot I wasn't even Isaac this run. This was Eden. Just found Isaac uh, in an item room. Sadly, I can't get any charges out of uh, Mega Satan, so... That's a little less useful. Oh, thanks. You're swell, dude. Having two keys and whatnot. If I just get a ton of chests on this floor, I have a chance. 
not the D12. Remember, I don't have to go back uh, until I hit a double charge, which is nice. So, we get to stay in business here. Keep going. Hopefully, get lucky. Don't want the dead cat, but it's nice if I get two things to reroll in a room in case I, for some reason, take stuff. But I'm not going to. Unless I find the item, and then I'll take anything, I guess. So that, that would be a reason to have two things in the room. Okay. Ah, dang. Can only do one more of these rooms really looking forward to clearing out the full path, but gotta come back now. Alright. No. No. What a sad life I have going on right now. Skipping all these good items. Purely so I can find the one item I'm missing, and I probably won't even find it somehow. Working on miracles here, so you know. I don't know if we'll get a full double charge out of this. It doesn't look like it. Cool, got the black heart back. Uh, and that's a reason to still reroll after we uh, beat Blue Baby. But I think there are just exactly enough rooms to not get it. Which is really unlucky. Oh no, there's a room over there that I didn't see. I think we got this then. Hopefully that means also that we've got the item to show up. But we'll see. We will see. I really will have to wonder if my unlock is somehow bugged, and I, like, need to beat... I think it's Hush with Kane again. It's an item. Okay, I'll take that. Excuse me. Oh, no, that's... Yeah, the, my tears are good now. Good. Okay, I don't need to do that last room, but it could drop a battery, so I have to do it anyway. So tractor beam, my tears stay in that beam, no matter what. So the whiz no longer applies to me. I live a happy life. So we've got two more rolls. Dang, man. Never lucky. But maybe we'll get a battery in here. Or, you know, the item from chest. that also work. Nope. Alright, let's just kill Mega Satan for fun then. Oh, none of these are even, like, worth taking. One day, man. One day it'll show up. But devil plus two damage is good. Hm. I killed him before the double damage killed the hands. That's surprising. Don't know exactly how I pulled that off. <laughs> Gonna have plenty of black hearts here after Super Envy? No. You can still get the Gimpy glitch basically, uh, except with black hearts, unless that was fixed. But I, I have gotten the Gimpy glitch, but with Serpent's Kiss, where each piece of the Super Envy basically dropped a black heart and I filled half the room with black hearts. It was really funny. Alright. He's gonna die pretty much instantly. See? No problem. That was a long run. It's bet up at the end, of course, but that was a long run. Still just missing this silly D12. Alright, that's gonna do it for today. I hope you enjoyed the episode. Thank you for watching. And I will see you next time.